They may be known as the little giants at Fremont Ross, but when they're on stage, they make a big noise. And joining us in studio today is Elizabeth Hamaker, the orchestra teacher for the little giants. Hello. Thank you so much for coming in. My pleasure. Over this past weekend, I want to make sure we get this right, the Ohio Music Educators Association District Contest. Tell us, how did your students perform? Um, district contest was actually state orchestra this weekend was held at Perrysburg High School and uh, our Fremont Ross uh, senior high school got a superior rating and I also took our junior high students on Saturday morning and they got an excellent rating and I really feel that the students enjoy the rigors of going to these competitions it brings them to a whole new level of excellence that maybe they didn't know that they had inside of them and it's really uh, rewarding to see them um, grow and how quickly it happens and then they get their comments back from their judges and um, even take that information back to the classroom it's very enriching for them and thrilling for me I just love it <laughs> I know so many hours of practice for just a few minutes of performance that's true what was the work that went into this um, for the junior high we uh, rehearsed for the full week before our contest um, during the early hours from 7.30 to about 8.05. And then the students would come back to class during their regular class time and we'd refine some things. And at the high school, we would just hammer it, hammer it, hammer it. Um, we did a really great job of listening and um, trying to fulfill all of the aspects of the musical expectation while maintaining our um, academics and other activities in sports. What are the musical expectations for Fremont Ross? For my groups, I expect um, the rigors that are required to be in these competitions. And we don't take them lightly. The students don't take them lightly. Some people have called me as serious as a heart attack. I, I know I am very serious. <laughs> and that all of my friends are between the ages of 10 and 18. But I really love what I do. And I believe in the kids. And it, they're my joy. It's important to be serious, that hard work pays off. Yeah. We can see how excited you are when you talk about Fremont <laughs> Ross. How long have you been with the Little Giants? Uh, eight years. Eight I'll years. be finishing eight years, yes. What have you learned in that eight years with your time there? Um, it's a very tight-knit community and there's a lot of love there and uh, that community puts their kids first and I love to see how the teachers and the staff and the faculty all across the school district put their students first. And it really is a, um, it is a love affair with the kids. We just, we love on them so that they can be successful regardless of what they're facing. We try to prop them up in as many ways as possible to help them be successful individuals. Now we have the opportunity to highlight Fremont Ross day in and day out here with the athletics. And as that goes, I'm assuming some of your orchestra students also in band yes. participating in the stands night in and night yes. out. Yes. How have you seen the orchestra side of things benefit them for those performances on a Friday night? Um, well, the students who perform in both the band and the orchestras or in the orchestras and the choirs have a higher skill level because they hear it repeatedly. Um, the other directors have the same rigorous expectation that I do and it just helps the students become better at what they do and the discipline that they take away from the program will serve them well in their futures. We take pride in highlighting them every night. Thank you again Thank so much you. for coming in and talking about the Little Giants. So glad we could be here.